Greetings! Welcome to Fairies Tutorials. Are you a 10th grader studying the area of food, nutrition, and health? Well, you're in the correct space. This video is just for you. In today's video, we will be exploring the course Food, Nutrition, and Health. Let's see what it's all about. Baby, go! Areas of discussion. One, we're going to look at the resources needed for the subject. Two, we're going to look at an overview of the syllabus. Three, we're going to look at the school-based assessment. And also, we will be looking at the careers in food, nutrition, and health, along with the exam structure. Some of the utensils or the resources that you will need. Now, there are two aspects to this course. We have the practical component and we also have the theory component, right? Now, we're going to look at a list of basic practical items. You will need some more, but these are the basic to start off with. So you will need a food basket. You would need your PPE, which may be your white apron or your chef hat, along with your chef's jacket or your chef jacket. You will also need cover cloths, tray cloth, food mesh, table towels, pot holders, and of course, paper towels. And these are just a few items that are the basic items that you will need. You will need much more. Okay, now let us look at the theory aspects of things. You will need a two inch binder for your portfolio. You will need a protective sheet. You will need typing sheets, markers, rulers, rubbers, glue. You will also need cartridge papers, memory stick, and also an extra large notebook, preferably the legal size. Now, you, you are going to find that with, with this course, there are a lot of work pieces, not only practical, but also other pieces that you will have to use as evidence for your portfolio development, which is very important as it's a part of your SPAs. So let us now look at an overview of the syllabus. The food, nutrition, and health syllabus is intended to provide opportunities for the development of skills in the planning, preparation, and presentation of food. In addition, the course provides an understanding of the nature of food and the principles of nutrition. The syllabus is divided into seven sections. They are one, diet and health, where you learn of key terms related to diet and also the different types of diet which contributes to good health and well-being. In section two, you learn about nutrition and health. So you learn about the study of nutrients and how it impacts our body and impact our body and the different types of nutrition related disorders. In section three, you learn about meal planning. You will look at some interesting terminologies that is related to meal planning. You will plan different types of meals and different types of menus for special persons and also for different occasions. In section four, food science and technology, you will learn about the production of food, the science and technology that's behind the production of food, right? Without science and technology, where would, where, how would we get certain foods, right? So we're going to look at that and also the biological aspect of it where we look at uh, principles of heat transfer. We'll also look at microorganisms that contaminate food and such alikes. Now, for section five, we'll zoom in on kitchen design and equipment management. This section has to do with like, the layout of the kitchen and also the different types of tools and equipment that are found in the kitchen and the ones that are labor saving. Section six is about consumeris consumerism and the purchasing of food. Are you a consumer? 
yes you are because at some point point in time you may purchase something right so we're going to look at the rights and responsibilities of a consumer and we're also going to look at the agencies or organizations that are responsible for protecting our rights and ensure that we have safe food to eat good now in section 7 the final section we will look at food management preparation and service this is where we prepare different types of food items and also we're going to zoom in at, on different types of cuisines yes good There's in food nutrition and health now these that i have here are are limited there are a lot more but we're just going to look at these highlight these few today dietitian chef fitness trainer food nutrition and health teacher a doctor a nutritionist and there are many more careers that you could think of that pursuing this course will help will steer you towards now finally let us look at the exam structure now you have two papers paper one consists of 60 multiple choice questions and question two and paper two has six short answer questions you're awesome you've made it to the end of the video don't forget to subscribe like share and comment thank you for watching